I think we're going to see a lot more options. Instead of having three options for sessions, we're going to see eight or ten options for sessions. And I think sessions are going to be much more participant driven as to what are your problems and what do you need to focus on so that we get to people together in the right places at the right times to talk about issues that they're really having so that can take things home with them. I think meetings and events will be different in 10 years and that they're going to be more interactive and more engaging because I think people have shorter attention spans with technology and so if you want your meetings to be really effective you're going to have to find a way to connect to engage because that's how they're going to retain their learning. I do think they're going to be highly digital and highly interactive um, but I do think we're going to integrate a lot of old school stuff like we went paperless on some things I think we're going to find that we need paper on some things. I think that our meetings um, later are going to um, incorporate a virtual audience with them. Things that don't work well are going to evolve over the next 10, 20 years. Things like audience engagement. We're really struggling right now to engage audiences differently. I don't think uh, we've caught up with where our audiences are. Our audiences have totally changed because of technology and shorter attention spans and we're still evolving as to how we engage different generations, different learning styles. Everybody wants a more individualized experience. So I think 10 years from now we're going to see a lot more of that, which is super exciting. I think we're also going to see a lot more in terms of the attendee curation. I think that our attendees will be able to make decisions on what content we cover at our events, who is the speaker, um, what they want to learn in a particular session. I think that's going to make it a much more intimate experience for the attendees.